This is the Dragon Quest Slime Controller for the Nintendo Switch, put out by Hori. Sega Head keeps wanting a controller review, so I just took the polos that we sent to him and made it a review. Ah, 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 there was a phone in my eye. All right, so um, the way I hold it... Um, He's looking at his balls. <laughs> yeah, this... Because when I hold it in my lap, not that you want to see, I have to be careful. I don't want to be like, BAM! Oh! Uh, so anyway, so the way I hold it is uh, like this. Usually one thumb here, all the buttons. The analog sticks, they're pretty good. They're both concave, which is kind of nice. The D-pad has a little bit of a divot in the center, if you can tell. So that's kind of interesting, especially since it's at an angle on here, which is kind of weird. Same with the buttons. I think it would be more weird to try to use this since it's at an angle than the buttons. The buttons, I don't mind. Star and minus, uh, they're, you kind of have to reach for them. As far as the shoulder buttons, generally I'll have it on the L and R, but I don't have my other fingers on the bottom triggers. They're usually more on the controller here instead of actually on there. It works pretty well. It's fairly comfortable. It's weird that he's upside down though whenever you're doing this. There's a turbo button that I've not done anything with. Near as I can tell, this controller was for this game and you could probably use it for any other one. It's not bad. There's a little butthole or charging slot. How long does it seem to hold a control or a charge? I charge this up before I started playing the game and I've swapped between this and the Pro Controller and I've not had to recharge this since. So I would say you're looking at probably the same kind of battery life as the Pro Controller. Is there a rumble feature in it? There is not. Good question. Is there a motion control in it? There's not. Just shaking my slime. That's good because you probably might poke yourself in the face but with that. I was thing. penetrating Lacey with this just a moment ago and you missed that and you can't use this polo. There's kind of a nice, almost matte finish on it, so it's not like super slick or anything. All of his features, they're like slightly rubberized. So I don't think that there would be a lot of uh, wear to come from the controller eventually. I always worry about this part. The only problem with this is putting it down, correct? Yes. If because... you're not having it on its cradle. Yeah. So there's Tom's review of the slime controller. Hi, my name's Gravy Tom. I don't review things. I don't know how to review things. I would get boring whilst reviewing things and forget what to talk about and not know what to say, so I don't review things. That was a quality review of a controller, you foolish. <laughs> That's, a big slime. That's just what the noise I imagine they make. <laughs>